Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a clothing and makeup haul. I haven't done a haul in a while and I ordered some stuff online from Ulta and I got some clothes for spring and summer. I went to Play-Doh's Closet a few weeks ago and then I went to Forever 21 last week so it's kind of a little bit of a collective haul. But um, we'll start with the makeup products from Ulta and then we'll go over there and we'll do the clothes and I'll try them on for you guys so you can see how they fit and so on and so forth. So, I really wanted to go to Ulta to get the Anastasia Glow Kits. I only ended up getting one but that's a whole other story. But um, Every time I would go, they were sold out. So I said, I'm just going to order it online. And you know what? I'm actually surprised because wherever they ship out of for Ulta, they must be really close to where I live, uh, Connecticut, because I ordered on Friday and today's Tuesday and I already got it. And they said I wasn't going to get it till Friday. So let's see what goodies. I've never ordered online. So, oh, cool. They gave me a little magazine with $3.50 off. So that's cool. I didn't know. I've never ordered online from Ulta, so pretty excited. All right, the first two things I ordered were these makeup remover cleansing towelettes by Neutrogena. I have talked about these time and time again. I'm literally way too obsessed with these. These are amazing at removing literally all of your makeup, and then you go ahead and pre cleanse and then cleanse your face, and you won't have any skin issues. Trust me when I say that. Like, I literally am. Whew, hair on my face literally way too obsessed with these and funny thing is I just ran out yesterday or what was it Sunday so this is perfect and I think it was like buy one get one 50% off or something so that's why I got two more bang for your buck and oh my god I'm so excited let me just put this stuff away so I uh, like I was saying I really wanted this Anastasia Glow Kit. So I got it in that glow, and there's another one, I can't remember the name, but I didn't get both because it was just too much money to spend at once. They're $40 each, so I've been $80, and I was like, mm, I'll wait to get the other one. I don't even know if I really want the other one because I guess this one is more for like tan people, and the other one's more for like fair. That's what I read online, so they made like glow kits that wouldn't have too much shimmer, so for fair skin, it wouldn't be so like in your face. This is more like in your face. So I said, mm, that glow is definitely what I'm looking for. So I am so excited to use this. You two be good, okay? I'm watching you guys. My dogs are in my room with me. Um, oh my gosh. Just look at it. I literally, hey, Coco, be good girl. Hey! They just aren't making too much noise. So this is Sunburst, and then the next one's Golden Bronze, Bubbly, and Dripping in Gold. So I'm going to do like the little four finger swatch. So four finger. Sunburst, Golden Bronze. Wow, these are so pigmented. Okay. Can you guys see? This is Sunburst right here. I feel like I'm doing like the shocker or something. Sunburst, golden bronze, bubbly and dripping in gold. <gasps> so pretty. I can't wait to use these like on my face. Oh, this is so awesome. It says four velvety powders that instantly cast a lit from within glow. Complementing shades can be layered together to brighten cheekbones and decolletage or worn separately over eyelids, brow bones, and inner corners. Results are flawlessly incandescent. Oh my god, I have a wedding to do Saturday. I'm definitely going to be using this on the bride, giving her that like beautiful wedding day glow. I'm so excited. I'm so glad this came in. And I just can't get over how pigmented these are. Like, look guys. Like, that's insane to me. I don't think I ever had like a highlighter that was like this, like boom. Like, I can't wait to use it. I should have used it today, but to respect the whole haul thing, I was like, no. Because you want to like be able to just like be excited and not say you used it. You know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe I'm just a weirdo. But I really need to get this off my finger now. A few things. Oh, cool. I don't know what this is. Is that all I ordered? I'm like so surprised. 
I thought I ordered more. Apparently not. Okay, so this is something from Anastasia. It's a kabuki brush, maybe from ordering. You know what's annoying? Is they asked me if I wanted free samples and I asked for like perfume samples and they didn't come. So that's kind of a bummer. Let's fix that hair. So this is what it looks like. And it's probably just a really tiny little kabuki brush. It's pretty small. So that's my little free gift. I think this is like a $40 value. I don't see how that's $40, but I probably will literally never use that. But that's okay. Thank you anyway. Um, and then I got this matte lipstick by NYX in Indie Flick. Um, I was watching a tutorial recently, last week some point, that um, Desi Perkins, she did a tutorial featuring this lip. And the minute I saw that, I was like, I hope she tells us what that lip color is because I need to get me that. And it was this one um, in Deflex. So if you guys don't know who Desi Perkins is, I would be really shocked because if you know who I am and you don't know who she is, then you are like a hermit or something. I don't even know. That wouldn't make any sense because she's just so amazing, so talented, and oh, I just love her makeup skills. She's just always looking fleekish, you know? Okay, so they make this packaging crazy tight, but if I can just go ahead and undo my packaging here I can show it to you guys so it's just like a really pretty like orange red but it looked more orange on her so I don't know it'll be interesting to use it and kind of just see how it looks so this is what it looks like and I'll swatch it here for you guys definitely like a orange red for sure I mean it's not even just orange. It's definitely like an orange red, but especially with me tanning, I'm really excited to see how this like looks. And then I got this NYX lip liner in hot red to kind of go with it. I don't know if it will because it looks a little bit more red. When you go online and buy things, it's a little bit more difficult to really tell if it's going to match because you're not there like, I'm just chipping the hell out of my nails. <laughs> you're not there to actually like swatch it. But I noticed that my Ulta's that I go to, these are always like never packaged properly. Like the NYX products like are never like um, sealed like this and people like swatch it and then you bought one that somebody like used. Do you know what I mean? Does that make sense? I don't know if that happens at your guys' Ulta, but I really don't want to use my teeth to get this. So it definitely is a little bit more red. Um, I think it can go, to be honest, if I like feather it in. I'm doing the red right above it, you see, I think it can go. Because, you know, we'll have to try it out. Trial and error. But I definitely want to see if that works. So, two NYX products, obsessed. And, yeah, I don't know why I didn't get any of, like, perfume samples. Because I definitely selected that. I'm going to just, like, double check. But I definitely don't think that happened. So, a little disappointing for all to the shipping people. You know, you totally could have thought about me. No, I'm kidding. All right, so now we're going to move on to the clothing haul try-on part. So I'm just going to clean this up, and I'm going to move over here where all my shit is, and we shall go do a haul. So here are the clothes that I got. So we're going to start with Plato's Closet. So, again, I'm sorry if you hear my dogs breathing heavily. They're bulldogs, like bulldog life. These are LA Blues size 8 jeans, jean shorts, I should say, and they are high-waisted. They look like this. They're a little bit longer than your typical. You know what? I had to put my dogs away because they're going to be loud. Come on. They're going to just be too loud because they're, like, playing and stuff, so I should have put them away for a second. So these are LA Blues size 8, like I'm saying, high-waisted the jean shorts from Plato's Closet, they're a little bit longer because I have a problem with jean shorts from the majority of places and my butt falling out of my jeans or my jean shorts, I should say, high-waisted or just jean shorts in general. I don't like that. I'm really not into that whole butt hanging out look. Not that I don't like my butt. I just think that, you know, your shorts should always cover your butt no matter 
if you have a nice butt or an ugly butt, that's just my opinion. And it's so hard for me to find shorts that literally don't show my butt, especially from Forever 21. My butt is forever hanging out, hence why I like wrap a shirt around my waist like a plaid shirt because I don't, I don't like that look. So these are long, they fit nice, and I like how they look and they feel. Next product, next product, next item is again from Plato's Closet, and these are just Levi's. These are the relaxed fit tapered leg and these are a size 7. So I really like Levi high waisted shorts because I love how they fit and they make your butt look nice. Some jeans or jean shorts really tend to like flatten out your butt and you know I don't really like that and I like how my butt looks in Levi's. So these are definitely really awesome if you're looking for like jean shorts or even jeans that make your booty look nice. Levi's are definitely, you can't go wrong. And I think I got these for like $8. So, and I think the other ones for like $8 as well. And then I got a pair of jeans and these are Levi's. These are the mid-rise skinny size eight. I love the feeling of these, these are so soft. And again, I don't really like jeans because they make your butt look flat, but Levi's really don't. And that's why I bought these. These were probably like $16 from Plato's Closet. And I really like how they fit on me and they're definitely a favorite of mine. So they are really soft too and really comfy. Okay, then I went to TJ Maxx and so I got this shirt and this is by Zenan Zenana Outfitters and this was $5.99. It's just like a black loose fitting uh, v-neck shirt. I really like like shirts that fit loose um, versus super tight because especially if it's not a crop top. If it's a crop top I like it more form fitting but if it's like just like a shirt I kind of like it more baggy I don't know I just feel like it's more comfortable so this is a size medium and that's again why I got a size medium because it will fit like loose and then these um are a size 9 blue spice high waist ankle high waisted jeans and again I don't really wear jeans but I really like the color and they're in like powder mint like a mint green which why is that like so bright against there? It looks almost white on camera. Um, but yeah, I just like these because they're perfect for Easter and this is actually going to be my Easter Sunday outfit, the shirt with the jeans. I just think it'll look really nice. So um, the jeans were $16.99, but they were originally 22. So a couple bucks off, you can't go wrong. And yeah, I really like the color, even though they look hella white on here. Um, it's just perfect for spring and Easter, so that's my Easter outfit. And then my next outfit, again from TJ Maxx, so we'll start with this shirt. I love this lace shirt. It's such a gorgeous pale pink, and this is by Sans Sos. I don't know, it's in small, and since it's a crop top, like I said, I like it like more form-fitting, so it's a size small. And I got it for $12.99, Sans Sosi. So, yeah, I just love how it's like this lace and, I don't know, a nice little bralette would look so cute, like a lacy white bralette or something under this. I don't know, but I just, you know, I had to have it, so. And then these shorts go with it. They don't have to all the time, but um, I love these shorts. They're loose, but they're, like, kind of dressed up, if that makes sense. And these were $12.99, and, yeah, I just really like these shorts a lot like they're loose but they look like they're loose and comfy but they look so put together so um i thought these were like a really really nice match together but you can always you know wear them separate and then i got these shorts as well from tj maxx and these are size large and these are 12 these were 12.99 and this is by blue seal or something blue seal I don't know um but how nice like these are white lace I feel like the detail isn't really showing up I feel like my lighting's so blinding sorry guys but um it's like see-through but it's not because it's like pleated under here so it's not see-through but yeah I just really liked these shorts and I don't know I had to have them so that's everything at TJ Maxx moving right along to Forever 21 
I got this really, really cute romper. And, you know, normally I don't think this would, like, stand out to me. I don't know. I like flowers and stuff, but, you know, I'm not, like, a super... I don't know, flower power kind of girl, but I just think this is really cute. And it's a size medium, Forever 21, and it was actually on sale for $10, and I really like that, and I wanted a romper. And this was originally $15.90, so it's just this really nice, like, loose-fitting romper, and it's just really comfy and soft and really cute for spring with all the flower detailing across it, so I feel like normally that wouldn't stand out to me, but yeah, it did. Then I got these shorts, which look like denim shorts, but, you know, they're like those, the same shorts I've been showing you right along, the really soft material. These were on sale for $9, so I got some really good deals at Forever 21, and these originally are $12.90, and these are a size medium, and I tried these on in the fitting room, because when it comes to Forever 21, jean shorts, shorts, like my butt always falls out. These, my butt doesn't really fall out too, too much, maybe a little bit, but um, I can pull them down and make, make do with them when most of the time I can't. So I really liked these, and they're just like that really soft material, so. And then I got this crop top which really stood out to me because it's like a mustard yellow and that's perfect for spring and summer. I don't have any crop tops like that are this color so I was like Mariah go for it and it was $9.90 but I actually got it for nine. So yeah like I've been saying I made really good with um, deals and this can go really nice together. I think this would be a really cute little outfit so. And then I got these like graphic shirts, they were on sale. Well, one of them was on sale. <laughs> this one just says chill all across it and it was $6.90 and I got it in a size small and it's sort of like a crop top but it's like a longer crop top um, but I just like it. Kind of cute just to throw on and go. And then my next graphic shirt was originally $8.90 but it was on sale for $4.99 and your girl loves fries, french fries, so figured why not get this. So that is everything for clothes for spring. I'm probably going to be doing some lookbooks for spring so uh, pay attention for that some styling videos. I have to get some spring shoes. Um, I'll be ordering those probably within the next few weeks probably online and I might do just like a shoe haul if that's something that you guys would be interested in like a spring shoe haul high heel haul whatever I don't know if that's even of interest to you let me know in the comments below and then also uh, do some lookbooks for you guys with these and whatever else I have that I can kind of throw together so I hope you guys enjoyed this haul and until next time I will see you guys very soon in my next video bye guys